coming up on our left, there's usually one or two ambulances sitting here getting ready for tonight's game. We're just about to turn left into the Titanic quarter or to give it its original name, Queen's Island. And this at one time was the entrance into the biggest shipyard in the world called Harland the Wolf. The shipyard employed 35,000 men with a further 15,000 worldwide. We don't build any ships here now in Belfast. The last ship to be built here was nine years ago and that was the Ampol Point. Just while we're sitting at the traffic lights, some of you may have seen the news this morning. It's a very sad day here today, not just in Northern Ireland, but throughout the whole of Ireland. It's a very sad day because here today in Ireland, we buried the Irish world champion, Pokey Pokey Dancer. It's a very sad day here today in Ireland. We buried the Irish world champion, Pokey Pokey Dancer, and it took 10 hours to bury him. Because every time I got the left leg and he put the right leg out. I had to think of something for goodness sake. We're sitting here on traffic lights. I don't know about you lot, but I was getting pretty bored. <laughs> These traffic lights change once every Tuesday. <laughs> now when we get through these lights coming up on the left hand side, we're going to see a little ship called the SS Nomadic. This was a little tender ship that carried first and second class passengers out of shoreboard to the Titanic. It was then sold off to a French businessman. He then took it over to Paris was sat on the river Seine, just below the Eiffel Tower. He cut off the funnel on the top deck and turned it into a floating restaurant. We brought him back here to Belfast. We quite recently just spent nine million pounds having it completely restored. And if you've any interest in the Titanic whatsoever, this little ship coming up on our left, the SS Nomadic, is a must visit while you're here in the city.